Hello guys, welcome back to Ventslate, and here we are. I am getting ready for the Abyssal Tournament. Alright, I, I think I have still a few more to go with my normal season upgrade. However, when it comes to my AT, alright guys, let's get into it. Um, I, I leave it to a little bit later in the day because that's really not, not much point getting in too early because you're gonna face all kinds of difficulties. Like I always say, timing is key. All right, let me set this up for the gold gun. I think a lot of people have been asking, hey, what is a gold gun? What happens in a gold gun? Should I do this? Should I do that? Should I not do this and that? So here you are. This is gonna give you a bit of a situation on what to do, all right? We want to max out our fairy charm just so that we can get our fairies and this is to balance things out regardless of whether you like it whether you hate it this is something you're gonna need especially here on might and especially when it comes to tactical insight tactical insight is probably one of the more popular ones that no one wants to talk about um wait hold on let me get rid of this all right let's get to the next one yep to that and three of the break and now we're gonna get another six of these bad boys so we can be able to farm one of this bad boy if you're curious what am i doing how am i getting all of these things how do i get a balance of all of this very very simple okay join orca i i don't know what else to tell you if you seen this video, you didn't join Orca, guess whose fault it is? You. You are going to be the fault. Alright, there you go. Go gun. It is going to be the key for this game. I'm going to lock it up. Use it. Spend it. Smash this bad boy out. Okay, so. Just like everything else. I'm going to go to the crafting. Before we go to crafting, we're gonna set it up. One power swipe, three adrenaline rush, three doom. Nothing more, nothing less. Everything is the same. Everything is the same. Okay, cool. Let's see where we go. So instead of you tapping, you can just swipe it on your screen. Uh, hit the go gun at the very top, and it should be able to unleash out just a quick leveling situation. Alright, as long as you have enough gold with it, you're gonna keep it up, that bar will not drop. But as you can tell, the moment it starts dropping is when nothing is happening when it comes to levels. With the levels not happening, you're not gonna get the gold to be able to keep pushing. So, it's a, it's a very simple concept, right? The gold gun, the more gold you have, the more you're gonna be able to push. The less gold you have, the less amount you are able to push. Pretty much exploratory, nothing crazy, nothing difficult, nothing insane. But there you go, as you can tell, not much is moving for me now. So let me see. Ooh, let me get the go gun. 10k. Splash, splash. Yup, sure, give me a splash. Jackpot. Smash it all out, gun blade. Yep, got that. Got this. Boom. Shaka wow wow baby okay so there we go next we're gonna keep this going keep this pushing while we're pushing this what i'm gonna get is the pet with this is gonna give me a bit of a skill points gun discover 24 let me have a look how to storm 100% gold gun needless to say Pants can ship me, yeah, nah, probably not. These two bad boys. Hmm. Get this Twilight Boost. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Critical hit is literally the uh, pinnacle of damage. Gold Gun is gonna be part of that. No, wait, hold on. I don't know why I got Divine Retrib. Retribution, but that's not going to be part of it. All right, let's scale it back up. Get back to the top. Five, 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 five. 
5% on all of these bad boys. So at least we get a bit of income and damage. And we're going to spend it all on the Book of Shadows. Hit it back out. Go back out. Let's go. Speed this. Speed the demon out. And be able to get whatever we have to. Mm, look at the gun. Let's keep going. Alright. Okay. I think we have reached our limit. We're going to keep prestiging. And we're going to keep going. Look at that. 137. So this is going to get us to the next level. So guys. At the end of the day. Don't be too stressed when it comes to this. Um, in the 80. Make sure you farm level 10. Join Orca. That's all I'm saying. Join Orca. You're going to be able to figure it out. And you're going to be able to get to where you have to. And you're going to be able to farm level 10. Don't worry about getting first place. When it comes to AT, it is really not worth it. Nothing really changes. So you might as well just farm level 10 and just let it be, okay? Alright, guys. Well, this is the start of it. You saw how I started. At the end of the day, you just have to join Orca. Figure out what the stats are. And you'll be done. Very simple. Don't make it harder than it has to be. Stop asking about how this can be. This, uh, can I, how can I get through my software hardball? Guess what, guys? The new update is going to change everything. So don't worry. Things will be different. This will be a completely new game. You're going to hit the 180,000. You're going to join us. And you're going to have to beat a lot of people ahead of you. But it is a challenge that is not difficult. It is a challenge that is achievable. So this is what is going to happen for you guys okay all right guys well thank you very much for you know subscribing liking it and as i get towards the end of this uh, tournament as you can tell i'm very tired but irregardless tired not tired you gotta pop out the video make sure people know what's going on keep everyone informed so that everyone can do the best that they can and at the end of the day man, that is it you know you just gucci it Keep pushing on all right thank you guys i appreciate it if you come to this far of the video drop a like drop a subscribe that will help a lot and i'll keep posting all these videos i'll post a video towards the end of this and you'll be able to see what happens and if i actually achieve level 10 that will be the key thank you guys catch y'all later bye bye